the night. Well, this one thrown over Ortiz, and Ortiz wants a piece. But Lance Carter trying to make his way out. Hall will grab him, and the bench is real empty. Well, several of the Red Sox getting in there at Carter and others very quickly. Well, the first guy that I saw out after the pitcher was Trot Nixon. Blaine Neal, big dude right there trying to yeah. keep Nixon under control. But he's the first guy that I noticed out toward that mound trying to get it to uh, Carter. Well, they did get out there in a hurry, too, as uh, home plate umpire Ted Barrett was holding on to Ortiz with all he had. Well, somebody, somebody now here uh, in a Devil Ray uniform with a with a shirt on wants a piece of some Red Sox player, but they got a group over there waiting for him. Juan Brazelton, yeah. Nixon has been in these type situations in this building before here at Tropicana Field against these Devil Rays over the years. Well, you've got to throw the pitcher out of the game. Carter's got to go. There's no, no question, question about yeah. that. He has got to go, especially with the warnings already assessed. Now Ted Barrett, the home plate umpire, is really starting to take control. He's getting upset and he wants to move all these uh, Devil Rays back toward their dugout. I mean, he's got to be thrown out of the ball game along with Lou Pinella. You usually throw the pitcher right. and the manager out. And if he didn't think this was intentional, I mean, that's head hunting. That's right over the head. And big Poppy got hot in a hurry. You know, there's a difference being hit in the leg and in the foot and in the thigh than there is at a ball thrown at your head like that. Now, there's one in the sitting behind Ramirez and then one over the head of Poppy Ortiz. And the guys that have been hit in the series have been on the lower side. Nothing really up top. Until now. There's Nixon. Uh, Nixon going right after, I thought, the pitch of Carter. Yeah.